Uh, we can always uh, dream of what, what could have been, but um, I personally feel that uh, even, even if we didn't have the traffic, it would have been very difficult to beat Sebastian. I think they were looking after the car a little bit towards the end of the race. Um, even though our pace was very, very good, I don't think we could have really had a go at him. I think the team's done a great job. I mean, we are the second quickest team. We've been massively competitive in the last couple of races, the last four races, Jensen's done a mega job and um, of course we can improve uh, but that's what the team are doing, we're constantly getting better and better and closer and closer to, to the Red Bulls which is, um, which you can't necessarily say for anyone else. If Vettel's going to win the championship, whatever happens, he's, you know, he, all he's got to do is get one more point but um, we're working as hard as we can to really challenge Sebastian and Red Bull and I think, uh, I think there's, a, there's a win around the corner soon. I love going to Japan, I think it's a beautiful place and um, considering they've had some seriously difficult times recently I think hopefully we'll be able to lift the spirits of some of the people there and put on a good show, I hope the weather's good for us as well. Motorsport's huge for them you know, in Japan and they're massively enthusiastic about everything in general. We've got great, great fans there for our team as well so looking forward to it. Suzuka is probably the most challenging circuit. Uh, one, because of the layout of the circuit. It's very fast, it's very flowing. Um, you don't really get a lot of time to, to rest. Um, and also because it's a very narrow circuit. It's very narrow and there's no room for error. If you make a mistake, you go off onto the grass, through the gravel, into the barriers. You know, it's not one of these circuits that's like a, a car park. It's not all asphalt. It's still a proper old school racing circuit. So, yeah, one mistake and uh, you're in trouble. So, it's tough from that, that respect, and uh, I think we all really respect the circuit because of that. It's a very, very fast, high, fl uh, high speed circuit. You know, it's very much flowing. You need to get a real nice flow, particularly through the first sector. And you go up the hill, so it's got great undul undulation. Um, and then you come all the way down the back straight, which is quite long as well. It's very difficult to overtake at that track, but it's, it's all about positioning in general. We have some new parts coming to Suzuka, which will hopefully bridge the gap. Uh, and uh, I don't know how hard Red Bull are pushing at the moment, because they've pretty much wrapped up the championship. So um, it'd be interesting to see if they have any new parts on the car. We definitely do, and it should, uh, should bridge that gap and uh, help us challenge for a victory. There are areas we can improve on. We need more downforce, um, which they are working as hard as they can to, to find. So um, I have no doubts that the next few races we should be quite competitive. Yeah, to, to have a good result in Suzuka would really mean a lot because I love the circuit. I love, I love Japan and um, I think we, we really need to put on a good show for the Japanese people.